annual fee structure here is the information and uh, you can check the annual fee structure also slab one have very less uh, number of uh, seat and also less fee that is only 1.5 lakh but only 10 percent seats are there in slab one slab two have 20 percent seats slab three have 20 percent seat again and slab four have maximum seat that is regular fee non scholarship so uh, that is have six lakh per year you can check for the uh, most demandable branch in most demandable campus like Bangalore, Coimbatore uh, and uh, Amritapuri. For other branches like electrical 5 lakh uh, and uh, only 1.25 lakh and for other branches PCE, mechanical, triple E 1 lakh for slab 1 and 2.5 lakh or 3 lakh for slab 4. Cost and deposit 10,000 for all branches and hostel fee will be updated later i will inform you through a separate video and here is the term and condition to continue this fee that is if you get slab 1 that will be applicable only for the 2025 and 2026 academic year and to continue that it's if you are more you have to ask for each year then only you will get the slab 1 fee every year if uh, and for category 2 7.5 and uh, no any unwanted action you should do in the college and three is it's a clear each semester without any backlog if you get backlog you will get the failing to meet the aforesaid condition one two three and it will be required to pay slab three in subsequent fee uh, subsequent year so category one means if your slab is one now and it's if your score slab one will be continued if your uh, uh, slab uh, is 1 now but if you score 7.5 to 8 CGPA in, in uh, coming year then slab 2 fee you have to pay. If you will get 7.5 or le less than that then you will have to pay slab 3 fee. And uh, if you are in slab 2 now and if you will get 7.5 or above you will get the slab 2 fee continue. If you get less then slab 3 will be applicable in subsequent year. And once you get into the higher category means from slab 1 to slab 2 or slab 2 to slab 3 returning to back to it is not possible means 1 2 3 you have gone means slab 1 to slab 3 now if you score well and you want to uh, come from slab 3 to slab 1 that is not possible here they have mentioned clearly thing refund policy will be made as per the UGC refund will be made only after the admission of fee uh, submission of fee receipt provisional seat allotment later and no due certificate the refund will be made through account transfer to the account mentioned in the withdrawal request you have to provide a request in that they will provide you refund will be affected only after the final allotment refund policy is published in our website all refund policy will be online as per the above guideline so these are, these are the refund policy there will be surely refund policy every year they refund the amount if you are not interested in the seat Hi friend, this is Amit. Here I am going to inform you about my complete counseling guidance for a triple E exam as a centralized seat allocation process that is counseling CSAP. For that, I will guide you one to one. That is what is best for you, best uh, based on your rank. What will be the choice filling best order? I will provide you personally. You can join through my app or you can join through my WhatsApp also in the description. Everything is available. So one to one, I will guide you so that you will save your money by getting the better slab to pay less fee. Also, I will provide you three things: best slab, best branch, best campus out of your rank, whatever you have. So there is lots of thing, lots of critical thing in the counseling process. Once you do mistake. You may not get the best campus or if you get higher slab, you may, your parents have to pay more fees. So to save everything and get into the best possible uh, branch and campus, kindly contact me for complete counseling guidance. I will be guiding you one to one until your final admission is done. I will be connected all the time. You can call me, text me and there will be video session live also so that you can ask your question as well.